your last meeting with uh, Prime Minister Thatcher as president? Well, yes. Uh, sad thoughts. Uh, but uh, this will be the last time that we shall meet in this capacity. Madam Prime Minister, do you expect the Bush administration to be substantially different from the Reagan administration? Well, first, my thoughts are sad. And I thought the ceremony this morning was most impressive and I shall always remember it. And so this morning we'll be looking back and seeing what a different world it was when we both began in the early 1980s. But because it's in the nature of both of us, we shall also be looking forward. Because although I may not see the president in this capacity again, I'm sure I shall see him talk with him many more times. Do you expect a big difference with the Bush administration? Each and every person has their own style in politics. And people who share the same beliefs will put the stamp of their own style on putting those particular beliefs into action. President Reagan has a unique style, which the world has come to know and love. George Bush, too, will have his own style. But I think we're all very fortunate in the Western world for the first time, 
we shall have continuity of policies stretching over a second presidency following a first, and that gives enormous stability and confidence to the feeling of the world. Will you two stay in touch, do you think? Of course. Will you visit the ranch? I shall wait for an invitation first. <laughs> well, well. What, 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 President, why isn't, why isn't Dan Quayle coming to the state dinner tonight? You know, I don't, uh, I don't get involved in the, in the guest list there, and I don't know why or whether this was a, some other engagement or not, but uh, so I don't know the answer to that. Thanks. But believe I me, he will be welcome any time at the White House. I think he's coming to the White House. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I think our press is the last wave. I don't see many people I recognize in this wave. Yes. How are you all? Fine. Good, good. man. Now, this is the last time you're going to take the president and me in this room, so it's just really rather special. Very special for us, isn't it? Yes. You were just recalling, I think the first time that we were actually photographed together, um, as uh, being interested in politics was when the president came to see me when he was governor of California and I was leader of the opposition. So he came to see me in the House of Commons in my room as leader of the opposition and we talked then about what we wanted to achieve and how we were going to do it. And that was, what, 1977 or something like that? Something yes. Like that. So we've come quite a long way and done quite a lot together. Obviously, I'm so pleased to see him and have the chance of thanking him for everything he's done for freedom in the world. But of course, I'm sad that I'll not sit in this position with him sitting in that chair again. Because uh, we knew one another before the president was the president and before I was the prime minister. And we had the same political dreams and the same ways of achieving them. And we're both just recalling a moment ago that I remember the time when uh, Governor Reagan came to see me in my room in the House of Commons when I was leader of the opposition. So there are lots of times to recall, but I think the nicest thing of all, it's a very different world now and a very much better one and a very much more hopeful one than it was then. Yes, and the thing she says about the state of the world, she has played a major role in bringing those things about and these improvements. And I think uh, when you stop to think today that the unity we have and with the other allies in, the, in NATO, uh, I don't think very much of the world can remember when more than four decades of peace have followed as a result of that. That was staunch and consistent leadership. 
The president staked out the ground on which he wished to fight. He stood on that, on that ground and he fought and he won. I space, thank you very much. <laughs> Yes.